team athlete today? Every sport has that defining athlete, an icon, and when they perform, everyone stops to watch them. Horse racing has their defining athlete, and there he is. He is Flightline, coming in with an undefeated record of 5 for 5. But now the biggest test of his career, he takes from his Southern California base out here to Keeneland Racecourse in Lexington, Kentucky on this fall day, the highlight to the 2022 Breeders' Cup World Thoroughbred Championships. You're watching it live. Flightline will move into line in post position four in this field of eight at two to five. Will we see a historic performance or will we see a historic upset? We're about to find out. Flightline is ready for takeoff. Let's go up to track announcer, Kurt Becker. They are at the post. And they're off in the Longines Breeders Cup Classic. There goes Hot Rod Charlie, flight line, life is good, life is good, now strikes the lead as they head past the stands for the first time, flight line will go second, Hot Rod Charlie, third epicenter, quickly gets over to the rail, in fourth, Olympiad to his outside, now moves up one spot from the fifth position, Taba is further back toward the rail in the sixth spot, and then Rich Strike is in seventh, and Happy Saver last of the eight as they enter the first turn. Life is good against the rail, has the lead by a length and a half as flight line goes second. And a gap of five more lengths back to Hot Rod Charlie in third. 22.55 seconds, the time for the opening quarter. Olympiad then Taba. Now Taba's moved off the rail, moves up from fifth into fourth. Now draws alongside of Hot Rod Charlie to challenge for the third position. Further back, epicenter, rich strike, gap of six more back to Happy Saver who is last. Life is good though is the leader. Life is good. Guides the field up the back stretch. Leads it by two lengths. Flight line is second. Flavian Pratt checks over his shoulder. Seizes nearly ten lengths back to Hot Rod Charlie at third a length. Taba is in fourth and is followed by Olympiad. Rich strike. Happy saver at the back. 45.47 seconds the time for the first half mile. Life is good. The leader to the far turn and has it out to three lengths now. Flight line is second. It's a gap of ten back to Hot Rod Charlie. Olympiad then Taba. Moving around the turn for the quarter pole, here's Flightline. He was three lengths away, he was two lengths away, he draws within a length and a half of Life is Good, and this duo goes on past the quarter pole, into the stretch at Keeneland, and Flightline just moves right by Life is Good. Flightline has the lead, he's got it by two, he's got it by three, a furlong to go. Life is Good is second, gap of five, back to Taba. Flight line, a 16th to go. World class racehorse, world class performance, and a world championship event. Flight line has won the Breeders' Cup Classic. Flight line has come to Kentucky and he has shown once again why he is the most exciting thoroughbred we have seen in a generation. I'm speechless after something like that. It's emotional to watch a horse be so brilliant and at every move, Flavian Pratt making all of the right moves, just keeping life is good right there within his sights. It was a race between the two of them. Nobody else was ever even involved in this race. We do have to mention uh, there is concern for Epicenter. He did not finish the race. We'll try and follow that up, but we want to keep here with Flightline. But again, Epicenter did not finish the race. As far as the fraction, Simon, something doesn't make sense in the timing. They went to the three quarters and an astonishing 107 and four. That's essentially faster than the Breeders' Cup sprint earlier today. So that doesn't make sense with the final time of a mile and a quarter in two minutes. They might be revisiting Yeah, they this. might be revisiting this. I don't know whether the, you know, the mile and a quarter, they don't run it very often here. I don't know whether the timing system, the wind, whatever, but I'm speechless. I, 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 I always thought this horse was going to put a blowout performance, but you know, Flavian Pratt he did such a good job because there was always the appetizer to drop down to the inside and maybe take that gap, and, and he didn't. He knew what he had. He looked back with ultimate confidence about three or four times in his rearview mirror. And to your point, Christina, there were eight horses entered in this race, but only two showed up on the front end. It was a two-horse race, and when they crossed the eight,